Previously, on the hot show. But I was successful in transporting it for a while. But then there was this magical surge that stopped me from taking it. So, how do all of these diagrams help us find who set the watch? The store owner of the antique store, Mr. Alias, knows everything and had every single piece of ancient artifacts sent to him. I am Mr. Elias's aunt, Madame Krios. I'm looking after the store whilst he's on vacation. Are you a fortune teller? Well, no. I'm actually a psychic. There was a black shadowy figure that came out of her fireplace, and that explains who sent the watch. It wasn't a pony at all. What's bugging me is that I've never seen your parents before. I mean, where are they? It's time to get up! Tank? Tank, are you okay? You don't look so good. <gasps> you have a fever! But uh, I don't understand! You were fine last night! How could you have gotten sick this quickly? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? This has never happened before! Okay, come on. We should go to Fluttershy's cottage. She might have an idea of what is going on. She's an expert on animals. Fluttershy, open the door! What's wrong, Rainbow Dash? Are you okay? No, I'm not. There is seriously something wrong with Tank this time. He has a high fever and he's struggling to breathe. Calm down, Rainbow. I can help you. Whenever pets are sick, I know how to take care of them. Goodness! His fever is worse than I thought! His bag of ice melted just like that? How is that even possible? Why didn't you come to me sooner? Because I only discovered he was sick when I got up this morning! I see. That makes more sense, actually. So you don't know what could have caused his illness? No! If ice packs didn't work, then good old medications should do the trick. I just don't know what to do. I've tried everything that would usually cure a fever. Maybe it isn't a fever. But it has to be. We have all the signs, the rising temperatures, dehydration. I don't know what else it could be. But Tank can't get sick. We were going to have fun in the snow together again. Just like yesterday, we promised. He can't give out of it just because he's not feeling 100%. There has to be something you can do to help him. Anything! 
Hibernating is healthy for him. What you're doing could hurt him biologically. Nah, he looks perfectly fine. I think I know why Tink is ill. You do? Have you found a way to cure him as well? <sighs> Rainbow Dash. Yes? This may have been caused because he's not hibernating. Hasn't been hibernating? That's just ridiculous! I am serious! He may have gotten sick because he hasn't been hibernating! Why would that have been? He was perfectly fine yesterday! Tortoises are cold blooded creatures. They have to stay warm. So, he was warm under the quilts of my bed last night. No, Rainbow, it's not just that. You've also disturbed his biological balance. No wonder he's sick! No, you, you're lying. Aren't you, Fluttershy? I'm sorry, Rainbow, but it is your fault that Tink is like this. Because of how selfish you were, Tink is really ill and needs your help more than ever. If his condition gets worse, there... There might be no hope for him. Uh, you can't say that! How can you say mean things about him? He hasn't done anything wrong! You have! I know this is hard to understand, but it just has to be said. Sometimes the truth can hurt, and it feels like the pain never leaves your sight. But knowing this now before it's too late could save his life. If you don't, then... then... No. No way. Are you saying that if Team doesn't continue hibernating, he might... I? That could happen. Unless you get Tink to hibernate again. It could be the only way to save him, if that's the case. I can't do that. Why not? Even if it could save his life? This watch granted me a miracle, and I'm not going to waste it. And how do you know that he's going to die, animal expert? <gasps> you win. Wait, what? I said you win. Why though? It doesn't make any sense. What I said should have hurt you. Like you hurt me. I was cruel. Why do I win? I can't make you take Tank back. I'm just giving you the choice. You have to decide for yourself. Either Tank goes back into hibernation, his life can be saved, and you won't see him for another two months. Or he doesn't, and his condition will get worse and worse. And you can never see him again. Fine. I'll get him to hibernate. Happy? Ugh! Go on, Tink. You need to hibernate. It's for your own good. What's going on? What is that force field? Ugh, just ignore it. Come on, again! Uh, what, the, what the heck is going on? Why isn't it letting you hibernate? Because it was all a part of your wish, remember? What did you do to Tank? You wished for Tank to spend some time with you at Harf's morning. So he simply cast a spell on him to make sure he never happens again. That way you'll never have to wait months to see him again. But, according to your wish, it would mean that he would only be fine at Hartsworth. Then, the effects of winter will take over! <laughs> but, if Tank doesn't hibernate, he might die! He's really sick! It doesn't look like I care. This was your wish. A wish that can't be reversed. You deal with it yourself. I just gave you a much needed lesson. Care about others before yourself. Seems fair, doesn't it? Element of loyalty. Ugh. You monster! I can't believe I trusted you! Lucky you can still sleep. You can't. That was also part of the spell. Your fault. And bonus. He only has three more days until he succumbs to his disease. What? But, however, 
there is a riddle that might break the spell. I mean, there is a way to cure him? Here is the riddle. Look to save your pet. Unique ditty must be sung, and then you're set. Love to your tortoise, I may add. Look for a herb unusual and bad. Adding the rainbow goddess still. Choose correct. If the wrong one sung, your feelings forever will be stung. What does that mean? That's for you to figure out yourself. Adios. <laughs> No way I'll be able to fix it. Not just the watch, but this mistake. <sighs> Come on, Rebo. You can think a way out of this. I'll have to tell Fluttershy. Uh, what are you doing back here with Tank? I told you that he needed to hibernate, remember? I know, but I couldn't do it. What do you mean you couldn't do it? I mean, no matter how hard I tried, I couldn't get him to hibernate. The watch put a spell on him or something. That was part of the wish. But he couldn't sleep either. I tried to reverse the spell myself, but then the watch shouted in front of me, and now I'm really worried. I'm sorry. I was just so worried about Tink that I forgot about your feelings for him. If it is true that you physically can't get him to hibernate, then I don't blame you anymore. But now, there really might not be any hope for him. That's not true! Wait a second. What if Twilight knows something that could help us? She knows a lot about this sort of stuff. You're right. Maybe we should go to Twilight for help. She was suspicious about the watch after all. Then let's go! We really need to hurry! Why? I forgot to mention. Before the watch shattered, it told me that Tank only had three days left to live. What? But the watch also said that there was a way to cure Tank before the three days are up. It was a riddle. I think it went like, Look to save your pet. Unique ditty must be sung and then you're set. Love to your tortoise, I might add. Look for a herb unusual and bad. Adding the rainbow goddess stone. But choose correctly. If the wrong one sung, your feelings forever will be stung. That seems like a really difficult riddle. Yeah, well, it's the only way to help Tank right now. And it can't be any song? Nope. Hmm, maybe it's your lullaby. When was the last time you sang that? Last night. Perfect! Why don't we sing it together and see if it does anything? Okay. Little Tanky, please do not cry now. I will always be by your side now. If the weather starts to get too cold now, I'll never leave you alone. Tank! Tank! We just got worse! If the lullaby isn't it, then what is? You will never find out, little ponies, for what lies ahead will surely shatter your existence. You still need to find the goddess stone to properly cure him. And, of course, the room. And the song you sang to him was wrong. I'll give you three more chances. If you get any of them wrong, he'll only die faster. Better luck next time. What was that? Uh, the watch? Even though it's right here. The voice of the watch. Uh, three more chances. Okay, that's not good. We better hurry. Let's go to Twilight now. <coughs> Hello? Twilight? Are you here? M maybe she's not here. Why wouldn't she be? It's because she's gone out. Where is she? I don't know exactly where she went, but she did leave this note just in case you just so happen to visit. 
I haven't read it entirely. I just know that it was addressed to you two. Dear Rainbow Dash and Fluttershy, Rarity and I have left for Canterlot for important research matters. We should be back later today, but if you're reading this, it means it has taken longer than expected. Be sure to greet Applejack and Pinkie Pie if we're not back by then. Twilight Sparkle. Uh, they left for Canterlot? I guess. I didn't really know anything about it. What are we waiting for? Let's go on the next train to Canterlot! But you don't even know when the next train leaves. Oh, wait, I'll be able to help you. Oh, no. What is it? What is it? It says that the next train leaves in eight minutes. <gasps> then we really better get going. Uh, oh, what a coincidence that they are all here. Just come on! We don't have time to dawdle! Fluttershy, what are you doing here? Twilight, I have some bad news! Tank is ill! <gasps> How did this happen? It was the watch I got for heartwarming. I wished for Tank to come out of hibernation, and then he got sick. Oh my, he really doesn't look well. Does he have a fever? Yes, but a really high one. Not even Fluttershy could help me cure him. So that's what you wished for. We were trying to figure that out all morning. Uh, wait, you two knew that it had wishing powers? We kind of figured that out when you shot past us on a sled yesterday. You two saw me? Yep, but we didn't see Tank. We just saw you. That makes more sense now, darlings. Before, Applejack said that something that had made Rainbow sad has made her happy again. That thing must be Tank. Not anymore. Not if Tank is sick. It gets worse. The watch was the one that cursed Tank after I made my wish. And it also told me that Tank only had three days to live before he succumbs. Then it shattered right before me and I couldn't fix it. <gasps> Wait a minute. That was the source! The what? Rarity and I went to this fortune teller called Madame Cleos to find out where the watch came from. It turns out that the watch was sent by a magical being, not a pony. And when we were trying to figure out the last pieces of the puzzle, who it was sent by and what you wished for, then she said that the source died. I bet when the watch shouted in front of you, that's when the source couldn't be found again. Hold on! Did you say that Tinky only has three days left to live? Uh-huh. That's terrible! But there is a way to cure him. Before the watch shattered, it told me this riddle. Well, Twilight, do you know anything? I'm sorry, but no. But I know some pony who might. Who? Princess Celestia Luna. Oh, but as you said, we better hurry. Why did the chicken cross the road, sister? To get to the other side! <laughs> no, I don't really get that joke. Oh, come on, it's a classic. Stick to the times! Celestia and Luna! What is it, Twilight? Well, Celestia, Rainbow Dash's pet is in a very sickly condition. There is a watch that could grant her any wish she wanted. She wished to spend her swarm with him. However, now he's sick. The watch said that the only way to cure Tank is with a riddle. This is what it said. Look to save your pet. Unique ditty must be sung and then you're set. Love to your tortoise, I might add. Look for a herb, unusual and bad. Adding the rainbow goddess stone. But choose correctly if the wrong one's sung. Your feelings forever will be stung. Oh. So, you know what that riddle means? It means you have to find a song to sing to Tank. That part's obvious. What about the stone and the herb? Yes, what about the stone and the herb? That's a little more complicated than you think. Wait, I have another idea of what the song could be. What? What about the song that we sung when we were searching for the perfect pet? Flutters, we made that up on the spot. There's no way I'm going to remember it. No, Rainbow, my 
dear. Uh, Fluttershy, I don't think it's that song. Besides, I wasn't just meeting Tank. I was also meeting other animals that might have been my pets too. Also, the watch said that we only had three chances, otherwise Tank will die faster. All right. The watch did say that, didn't it? And there was only one being that could have sent you that watch. Your demon fall. <gasps> What's a demon fall? A demon fall is a being that comes from a pony who experiences grief for the first time. Once that foal is created, it feeds off of your grief of that certain subject. The more you do to stop the inevitable, the more powerful it becomes. It is also more powerful the more recent it's created. When the feeling is sad When her day is all bad That is when it appears her demon fall is near, but it only happens one time. When her cutie mark shines, there can be only one. Hence, the counts of demon mares are none. Legend tells of a creature that feeds off of one's grief. They were vicious creatures that cannot be redeemed. That's right. I guess the first time I did experience grief was less. No. What about the time when I was five and demon foes are only created after the filly earns her beauty mark? That incident probably happened before you got yours. Oh, that makes more sense. Back a thousand years In our teenage years We had demon foes too they said we're coming after you, but we had fought them alone. Though it was quite tough, maybe they'll rise again, and soon they might take their revenge. Legend tells of a creature that feeds off of one's grief, but we destroyed them years ago, so their time was brief. But if it's true that you have one that decides to your pet then we must take action it could become a threat the watch also said that Tink only had three days left to live then we haven't much time at this moment Rainbow's demon folk could be feeding off of her grief for Tank we must get moving straight away well, what are we waiting for? Let's find this demon full thingy and cure Tink together! Yes! Oh, yeah! I'm afraid it's not that easy. Only one of you can go up against me. That is the rule. If all of you go, you won't be able to cure Tink in time. It won't matter if you defeat me. If you don't follow the riddle, then you will lose and I win. Which one will go up against me? I think I should. No, I'll go. I'm the one who got us into this mess. I need to fix it. Already? It's not your fault. The watch deceived you. We can't abandon you like this. There must be another way, right, Celestia? I'm afraid the demon foal is right. She is more powerful than any of us. If all six of you go in there, you would be in grave danger. At least if one of you goes, she won't be able to harm any of you, but it is still too risky. Even for one, 
If we disobeyed, we'll all be in danger. She is quite correct. I was going to choose Rainbow to fight me anyway. She was the one who started this whole mess in the first place. You don't have to rub it in. Right. That would just be too much fun. Anyway, good luck, everyone. If you can figure out my riddle and cure tank, then you win. But if you are not able to, you know what will happen. <laughs> we should probably go. We have little time to waste. Wait! You're coming with me? We know the way there. We'll be able to guide you to the destination safely. Okay. Can I say goodbye to my friends first? Of course. I'm sorry it has to be this way. I wish there was another way to fix this. We're sorry too. You're very brave to be going out there. Twy? Yeah? You wanna know the truth? I'm not. I'm really scared. Like, what if I never come back? What if I never see you guys again? If that does happen, I'll never forget you, okay? Thanks. Hi. Remember when we had all those competitions like the Iron Pony and the most Darren Pony competition? Well, I fought for Darren Pony. What? But why? You're risking everything to save your pet. Even I wouldn't be brave enough to do all that. Thanks, AJ. You're quite welcome, Artie. Yeah. <gasps> I can't bear to see you cry. Oh, Artie. <laughs> I'm going to miss you so much, darling. Me too. But no offense. You're getting water all over my mane. Oh, sorry. Oh, Rainbow Dash, I just wanted to let you know, if anything does happen to you, I want to say, I'm sorry. What for? I told you that Tink needed to hibernate. Then I forced you to cry to accept this hibernation. Then I completely forgot about it. I really am a terrible friend, and I didn't mean any of those things. That's not true. It isn't. You're a wonderful friend, Fluttershy. You were only trying to help me. <laughs> Please be careful. I will. I promise. Rainbow Dash! <laughs> Yourself. Be brave in the face of danger! Please don't, don't forget, forget about, about us. us! Even when you might forget about me, I'm never, ever, 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 ever gonna forget about you! Never, ever, ever! Bye, sugar cube. Bye, bye. We'll never, never forget, forget you! you.